right, we're a few minutes from totality here, and the light is starting to get a bit weird, so I'm just going to sit this. It's not going to necessarily film us, but it's going to film America, the Great American Eclipse 2024. I'm going to watch as totality descends on us. Uh, I feel like the Birmingham 17 was something like 76 to 80 years, 85. Almost there. So wild. What's wild is that it's like 90 plus percent covered up and you still can't look at it directly. So close. One was our official. We're roughly 302, 304, 3 Matt, chances of you witnessing this again are slim to none. We can't afford to fly you to it. There's a plane flying right into it. Look at that. Don't do that. <laughs> it's happening, Max. <laughs> Very deliberate and lucky people. Yeah. It's wild. Almost there. Almost there, Max. I can see the stars starting to come out.
some folks decided to fly right through it. Of course, they're because they're flying, they're only going to get a few seconds of flying through it. Here it goes, Max. Oh. Oh, wow. Holy crap. This is not going to film well at all. No. Sorry, you're just going to have to, y'all on the camera, are just going to have to view the fact that suddenly it became night. Yeah, no, it's gone now on the glasses. I don't hear anything nature this time. Oh, you oh. Cool. <laughs> oh, that was going to happen. Wow. You can see starlights. Twilight in every direction. Because it's still light around us. Guys, I, I can't even describe. Like you can see the corona. way it's ejecting mass from the star. Isn't this wild? Oh puppy dog. Are you, are you freaked out? This is it Zoe. This is the big one. Yeah. It's wild. No wonder people got freaked out in the old days. You can see some of the you see on the bottom edge how there's an ejection of mass. Active solar flare going on. Very bottom, basically. Yeah. Absolutely wild. I'm so sorry that I don't have a better camera for this. Oh, there we go. Clip a little bit. Terrible, but. Yeah, it's an outline. Ah, we're about to. Start moving on the other side of it. Yeah, you see the sun coming up again. Yeah. Yeah, it's moving out. Oh, the glasses 
Oh, there it goes. Look at the sun anymore. Jeez, you can't take a picture. Oh my god, I can't get the sun anymore. Glasses on. Oh, it's just like a tiny little, tiny, tiny. Yeah, just a sliver. Just a sliver. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well. You can see the shadow going the other way. It's okay, Maximus. The sun god is returning. Poor, poor Maximus, he doesn't understand. Unbelievable. A giant space rock just cast a shadow on us. Absolutely crazy. And within moments, like a few percent. There's maybe 5% of sun and it's already back to something approaching daylight. Oh, what a family moment. That's nice. Heard it was the kid's 12th birthday. What a birthday, huh? That's good stuff. The Great American Eclipse 2024. Oh, it's so much brighter already. And yeah. It's still just a sliver of sun. Yeah, no, it's, it's nothing. It's nothing at all. Let's see if I can... To show you okay, this is the teensiest amount of sun I don't know it's not really translating well to the video but you can see the transition away from light back to it Some folks were like, okay, well, Calypso, shadow over, and they're out. Nature waking back up. Yep, oh, it's it's morning time again. Cockadoodle do, cockadoodle do. Oh, look, the, the llamas are the 
Are those llamas? They're burrow? What is that? The animals came back out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh. This is only like 15% sun. And it's still pretty bright. Yeah. Gigantic nuclear explosion, 93 million miles away. Back to normal. I think it's probably enough, yeah. Right. Go to an even number, 17 minutes. <laughs> 